Yo guys, I'm so excited to announce that I'm going to be hosting the very first Creative World Cup qualifiers and they begin right now. Welcome to Scissors Time Trials. So this is essentially a death run, but it's not nearly as hard as the stuff that I built in the past. Don't worry guys, most of you should be able to beat this course. It's not nearly as difficult as the ones I've made in the past, but I have introduced a decent skill gap. So obviously the top players are going to be able to outshine and outperform by a long shot essentially the top three fastest times on this map will advance on to the creative world cup where there's a three million dollar prize pool the best part about it is that anybody can enter anybody can win you just need to be able to record your speed run so yeah the qualifier officially starts today and it ends on may 9th 11 59 p.m pacific and the winners will be announced the following day like i said this isn't nearly as hard as my other death runs but essentially you're gonna go ahead and start Start the map, wait for the countdown to start, and your time will begin the second your character is able to move. The moment you collect the 10th and final coin is the moment that the game ends and your time officially stops. I'm not going to give away all my tips and tricks on how to beat the map, but I will show you all the rules and you should watch this if you're wanting to participate. All right, so basically, there's a few different weapons scattered across the map. Actually, there's three of the same weapon all right they all have eight bullets in them so this first weapon i picked up has eight bullets and as you can see there's a coin i need to collect and i need to slide down this long hallway but as i slide down the long hallway there's going to be targets to my left and right that i have to shoot i don't necessarily need to shoot these targets but for every target you hit on this map one second is shaved off your time so there's going to be a total of 24 targets there's going to be a total of 24 bullets meaning you're going to be able to hopefully you're better than me at this map but again there's going to be a total of 24 bullets 24 targets so you can shave off a total of 24 seconds off your time hopefully that's pretty straightforward and not too confusing but here's another example of a little skill gap i've added so there's impulses here that spawn at the beginning and it's up to you guys to figure out how to get across this gap some of the more talented speed runners such as myself might use the impulses to go easily across the side wall here all the way over now it's up to you guys to figure out how to get through the map and collect all 10 coins as quickly as possible but as you can see i've added harder routes and easier routes to get through the actual map now you can't break down walls you can't skip levels by any means you have to play the map as it's intended use whatever you find on that level to complete that level now if you step on a checkpoint plate it will reset your inventory so you're not actually allowed to bring all of those impulses onto the next level here now again this is a speed running course so i don't doubt that you guys will be able to beat this map but it's a matter of how quickly are you able to beat this map the map was built with the intention of only one person playing it at a time but obviously you're able to play with friends you just won't be able to actually compete in the competition if you're playing with multiple friends because there's only 10 coins on the map you need to collect all 10 to win so it should appeal to you competitive players it should appeal to you casual players it's kind of a best of both worlds now this is one of my favorite levels it's gonna be really easy to enter for you guys all right all you're gonna have to do is upload your submission to youtube with the hashtag scissors time trials and then also use the link down below there's gonna be submission form down below in the video description be sure to check that out if you guys are serious and actually want to compete and qualify for the creative world cup you're gonna need to enter with that it's really simple really easy basically just give us some basic information on how you did and what your name is and stuff i will say this level is going to be one of the more difficult ones on the course it's not a super long course by any means but this one might trip some of you guys up might make you rage a little bit but trust me you guys will be able to beat this map now as i mentioned before there's going to be three total weapons scattered across the map they're all the same weapon and they all only have eight bullets and every time you're going to see eight targets you have the option to shoot all these targets or you could simply continue on and try and beat the map if your accuracy maybe isn't that great but for every target you hit again one second is shaved off your time i'm really excited to see how skilled some of you really are out there then you're going to drop down pick up a weapon there's eight more targets in this room and uh you get again you don't have to shoot the targets but it saves time in the long run anyway you're going to collect another coin move on to the next level these jumps are not nearly as difficult as i've shown you guys in the past moving on to the final level um which i like to call ice mountain you're given a crap load of impulse grenades and your goal is to get up ice mount a lot of obstacles in your way it's a long ways to go but hey you've got impulses so i'm excited to see how quickly you guys can get up this hill now once you're actually able to make it up the mountain your goal at the end is to jump the gap grab the coin and win the game so there you have it folks that's scissors time trials again 
This is the qualifier for the Creative World Cup where there's $3 million in prize pool money. Can't stress this enough. It's amazing that literally anybody's able to enter. This map is a lot of fun. Even if you're not going for world records, you're still able to compete and have fun and challenge your friends to see who's the best. So yeah, I created yet another death run, but this time I went a little easy on you guys. It's amazing that there's $3 million in prize pool. It's amazing to see what your support can help do for the community. So please, if you guys are new here, it'd mean a lot if you could subscribe, like the video if you enjoy this content, want more stuff like this, to happen maybe leave a comment down below what you want to see from me in the future either way i think all the rules are pretty straightforward get through the map as fast as possible again there's 24 total targets you subtract a second for every target that you hit let's say it takes three minutes to get through the course you only hit 20 targets that means you're gonna have a total of time of two minutes and 40 seconds all right folks that about does it get out there and start playing the island code is on your screen now it'll all be also be in the video description again make sure to clip all your favorite most memorable funniest fast moments in this map can't wait to see what you guys come up with i can't wait to see you guys compete again subscribe if you're new like the video and i'll see you guys next time